Hello, 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 everyone. Thank you for tuning in. I am Jay Lee. This is Jay Lee's Corner. This is a quick gossip little time with Jay Lee to so come sip some tea. Y'all can see from dang on title Rose Ann lost her racist ass mind and assumed going on Twitter comparing someone to a ape to a monkey was a joke. You know what? This little white privilege of this damn number 45 president. Is he 45? Because he's not 44. Yeah, number 45 is just letting people think they can get away with any and everything. They are the big ass difference between a joke and some racist ass rhetoric. And Roseanne should know the difference. Why? Because she is an old white woman. So I guess she's using her old white woman ways to be in the world. Look, I did not watch the Roseanne reboot. I did watch the original Roseanne show I was honestly I don't have time to watch the reboot um because to me it's the same same old thing and you know when I heard when I woke up okay and I'm like Roseanne is canceled I'm like what was canceled for because it was just renewed for season 12 I come to the internet and I'm like she said what she literally tweeted Muslim Brotherhood and Planet of the Apes had a baby equals VJ. Now VJ was Valerie Jarrett. She was in a, uh, on the Obama's team when he was in office or whatever. I don't know the semantics of why she got beat with this woman. What I do know is everyone should be aware of certain things you shouldn't say. Certain things you shouldn't compare. You know what I'm saying? You can't compare anyone of African descent, anyone of color to an ape to a monkey you just should not do that i mean it's like what's the point and to think how was that funny how and i just don't get it and i am very happy that because after i saw the tweet i said now that's racist okay that's racist no matter how you cut it if you cut it with a black knife a white knife a yellow knife or whatever kind of knife it's racist and my thing is I don't know if Roseanne, look, people need to have their Twitters and tweets and stuff uh, monitor. Okay, if you are a white person and you're not aware of what could be racist, what should you say, what shouldn't you say, just ask a black friend, okay? And if you don't have any black friends as a white person, don't make black jokes because it means you not close enough to the culture to crack a joke. I'm not saying that a white person can't crack a joke on a black person. There's a difference between cracking a funny joke on a black person and crazy cracking a racist joke on, on a black person. And if you don't know the difference, sit your ass down and I support Trump since because if you, and let's not act like Roseanne is not a Trump supporter. Okay, she is in one way or the other. And the only sad part about the show being canceled is the other actors on the show who in turn also lost their job but this is the price you have to pay sometimes when the star of the show is a racist okay and i feel in my bones that a non-racist person would not have said that okay there were other things that she could have compared that woman to I feel like you, in moments of anger, in moments of I want to clap back, in those kind of moments, you show who you really are. And when you say, hey, you know, the brotherhood, what's the, 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 the Muslim, the Muslim brotherhood and planet of the apes had a baby. Okay, that sounds like the password to get into Trump's secret society. What's the password, ma'am? Uh, uh, Muslim Brotherhood and Planet of the Apes. Okay, you can come on in. You, you, you part of the white supremacy. 
wh where was it funny? Like, where was it a joke? I do not get it. I am happy sh the show was canceled. I'm sad about the other actors who I'm pretty sure. Not only the actors, the actors, the producers, the cameraman, the crew. S movie sets and TV sets and TV shows are more than just the actors on the set. It is also about the other people who have to feed their families based on working. So people who thought, you know what, I have a whole new season of jobs. I have a whole new season of checks. I can buy this house. I can buy that car. I can pay my mama. You know, I can do A, B, C, D, E, F, and G. Can no longer do that. Why, do you ask? Because Roseanne assumed comparing the black woman to a goddamn on muslim brotherhood and a monkey as a baby was a goddamn joke if y'all don't realize that y'all have to sometimes just say you know what fuck these white racist people then i don't know what to tell you and i'm happy that abc's president just so happens to be a black woman yes she said i'm not for this shit i'm not gonna do it uh channing dungy announced the show will not be coming back for an 11 uh, another season after it was already renewed for another season. The show had great ratings. Again, I wasn't watching it, but people were. Um, and for a, for a president of a company, for a network within itself, to make a decision to not bring back a top-rated show means we have no room, no space for the bullshit. You know what I'm saying? The, the, the um, statement she released said, Roseanne's Twitter statement is um, repugnant. It's inconsistent with our values. We have decided to cancel the show period and I felt like she did the right thing you know what I'm saying and I and I feel like black and white people should applaud her because my thing is I would hope even though I know this ain't true if the head of ABC was white they would do the same thing we know they would not have um but I'm happy that not only black people are applauding her but so are white people many other um, you know, Caucasian actors and, 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 and producers and just different people within the industry and even regular folk like myself who happen to be white. Um, I'm not white, I'm black. But other people had congratulated or thanked um, Channing for canceling the show and it's not accepting it. And my thing is, it would have been easy to say, well, hey, let's maybe just kill Roseanne off and have everybody else. You know, they could have thought about, well, let's put it on. They could have did other things to keep that show going. Oh, make her apologize. No, I like they did the ultimate. They canceled the goddamn show. And I'm pretty sure it was a hard pill to swallow. You know, we saw the actress who plays Darlene, who was also the producer on there. She's also one of the the, the woman, women on the talk. You know, she uh, wrote out about it. You know, we had the dude who plays DJ. He spoke out about it. The little girl who plays Darlene's daughter, I think she's also African-American, um, spoke out about it. How they all were saddened by what Roseanne said and and even that we have to live in this world now which is kind of crazy even deborah messing from will and grace saying how she was you know shocked at what was said and she's happy the show was canceled um because you just there's no space for that and sometimes if you let someone think my show is bigger than my idiocracy comments and my racist comments people will continue to be the white races they are and will continue to say well i can say whatever because they're not gonna cancel my show my show number one my show ain't going nowhere well you know what roseanne they showed your ass and not only was her show canceled her um talent agency or her reps or whatever let her go too at some point, we have to take a stand against the right white racist or any racist, anyone racist. Let me not keep saying white. This happens to be a white racist situation. We have to take a stand against racist people, against inequality to people of a different race. And we can look, white person, if you if you read this and you white and you wondering, well, how do I know if a joke is racist? If you're asking yourself that question, don't tell the joke. If you have to say, am I taking it too far? You probably are. And you know what? Just go ahead and delete it. Um, and you just have to remember, do not compare people of color to apes, to monkeys. That is racist. It is extremely racist. And in no shape, way, form, or fashion can you say, I didn't mean it like that. Because you said it like that. You know what I'm saying? And at the end of the day, you get what you give. You said some racist bullshit. You got fired, honey, from a lot of different things. And... 
people ain't gonna want to work with you right now i mean in Ro it wasn't as if roseanne was in the lap of luxury and was like wanted for all you know oh everyone's roseanne's on everyone's radar the show coming back was a surprising success so go ahead and float back up to you know to, 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 to no man's land and whatever money you've made live off of it and go ahead on like i don't i, I feel there's nothing that she can say to, i have no compassion for racist rhetoric i don't um because i feel like if you're a racist you're a racist like she's too old to change now it's in her you know what i'm saying it is what it is so the show was canceled who cares peace <laughs>